guys, I'm gonna show you how to put together the beautiful Beatrice bouquet. So, I have chosen a shorter vase because I think it looks best in a shorter vase with these beautiful disc buds. I've cut everything already so that it's about the right length for this vase. A little trick that I do is I put it on a table and then I hold my stems up and see about how high I want them. So I've cut these guys already, but I'll give them another little trim just before I put them in the water. I've also already added the pack of flower food, which is very important for your chrysanthemums. So you've got your five disc buds here. I usually start with these. I put them around the outside of the vase. I make sure that none of their leaves are below the water line. That's very important as it can kind of get the water a little dirty and affect the vase life of your beautiful mums. Next, I'm gonna add in my spray mums. These may come in a couple of different um, types of petals, but they should all be pink, which is very beautiful with this one. Sometimes some of the sprays will be a little bit too low if you've chosen a smaller or shorter vase. So you can pull these off and even just slip these in around the edges like this on their own, or you could add them to a bud phase, which is always one of my favorite things to do. I stand these two up in the middle to fill the middle, and I usually make sure they're sort of on opposite sides of the vase um, to kind of balance things out. This one in over here. Next, you're gonna pull your tulips, and you're gonna slide them in along the outside of your vase in between each disc bud. Your tulips are gonna grow quite a bit, um, so if they start looking a little floppy a few days in, you can just take them out, give them a trim, and they will start standing tall again. Next, you've got some irises. The irises are gonna arrive really tightly closed like this, but after a few days, they're gonna pop open and provide this beautiful purple and blue color to your bouquet. Again, they're gonna come long, so if you're choosing a shorter vase, you wanna cut them quite a bit and you can pull off the outer petals, or the outer leaves if you like. Some of them will also just fall off as you cut them shorter. And then you can just slip these in. Make sure they have enough room to open up, so this one's gonna be perfect here. I like to leave them a little bit taller too, just because they need that space to open up. Last but not least, you've got some ruscus. You are probably gonna have to strip the bottom of the stems so that the leaves, again, are not in the water. And then you can kind of just put them on opposite sides of your bouquet, slip them in there to give that little pop of green. And there you have it for Beatrice. <laughs>